Good day, good day. Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dano. How the hunk are you today? Yeah, welcome to uh, One Up Wednesday. What in the world do we got here today? <laughs> whoa, whoa. Uh, you know, I couldn't really tell you what we got here. Uh, I tell you what, though. Uh, as you all know, while I'm playing with the lights here, <laughs> once again, uh, you guys know that uh, I've got some weird little habits, and I've been kind of sharing that throughout our uh, time together. And uh, you know that I'm an eBay shopper uh, quite regularly because, uh, you know, Land Rovers don't grow on trees in central Wisconsin. <laughs> But anyway, one of my rules uh, for uh, Land Rover sh shopping on eBay is I don't buy from overseas. I, I just I just don't do it. Well, every once in a while, I'll take a gamble. I don't buy lottery tickets, really. I uh, do uh, gambling with my uh, money on uh, eBay with buying stuff overseas. And... Uh, on our one of Wednesday, I obviously bought this one from China. 187 scale. Uh, this is going to be a, uh, wow, uh, Discovery, a newer model. So let's take a look at this. Uh, I got this a while back, and uh, yeah, I just set it on the, well, wait a minute, what the? It's a model! Well, look at there! <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> yeah, that's kind of neat. Yeah, I collect anything and everything Land Rover. And uh, if I could pick it up for a song, and uh, I think I got this, you know, shipped to me for less than $5 or something like that. I, I'm not really sure. I didn't go back in the archives there. My, uh eBay purchasing there and find out, but I probably that's probably what I my extent of my gambling was was just five dollars. If anybody could tell me well, anything about this, do they know uh, Chinese? I don't. I <laughs> oh yeah. Well, anyway, um, very neat instructions. Uh, very cool. Um, yeah, hopefully we can see all the neat pieces. Obviously, this is the one of only that I have of this, so uh, I probably won't be uh, taking it apart and opening it up and looking at it. But there's uh, Ochre brand. I'm not really sure what that is. Oh, hey, it's a resealable bag. Well, let's take a peek. We could put this back together, right? Yeah, let's take a peek. Might have to set this down. So we don't drop it all over the place. But uh, little bags, got little axles still in the in the bag. That's kind of neat. Little metal axles. Here's the uh, the base to it. We're gonna really have a wonderful time looking at this little bugger, aren't we? All right, it's got a little 15 on it. Not too bad back there, uh, underneath there. G4, little spare tire. Some nice detailing there. Have to trim some of the flashing and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, as if you didn't know, one, um, one, uh, what is it, 87 scale? That's pretty small. And these little buggers are coming right off as soon as I pick them up off of the, uh, the tree that they were on. Yeah. So pretty good details for, you know, pretty accurate there for, for the, the wheels, here's the interior. Not bad, not bad. Like I say, this is a really small scale. So, uh, you know, the, the, uh, the, it's gonna be, it's gonna be hard to capture details in this small scale. That's inches right there. So, uh, yeah, we'll reference that again. But, uh, pretty neat, pretty neat. Um, I've never really seen this on, uh, on eBay again for sale, especially for that kind of price. Oh, we, oh boy. There's a front light, light bar there. 
headlights and we drop the uh, the main yeah the rubber tire got on there I wonder if I'll be able to get that off or not I don't know double sunroofs and this uh, what is that that's a LR2 isn't it yeah and here's the here's the little rubber tires yeah, not bad not bad little buddies there yeah anyway let's see if we can uh, open up the body here is that oh yeah that's got a little normally I leave all this stuff in the in the bag and all that cuz I'm weird like that <laughs> all right here we go this is the main body right there what's the doors are supposed to open really yeah look at that here's the doors pretty nifty wow yeah they got a pin or they snap into a that's pretty cool pretty cool yeah not a bad uh, detailed little little model I like model kits whoa little little touch up there needed for the front end but it'll have uh, the headlight inserts there yeah not bad. Oh, here's the back. That's got some detailing. Look at that. Discovery 3. Yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Well, they just blanked out the rear, so you don't have to worry about any uh, glass there. But there you go. That's a one out Wednesday. Pretty neat little model. Just a little bugger. Like I said, I, I'm like, oh, I'll take a chance and buy one of these for uh, it was under five bucks I'm sure but uh, do you guys have any of these do do you, do you guys take chances at on eBay uh, a lot of you guys are from overseas anyway do you uh, buy from your homeland only what uh, kind of uh, your kind of habits on eBay <laughs> all right well there you go hey guys remember subscribe if you can tell your friends about it we're trying to grow the channel so we can do some more exciting things so yeah don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends and uh hit the like button down below yeah and uh yeah go over to facebook also that's going to be in the subscription in the uh, description and instagram so there you go i'm not really sure what brand that is well that says uh 4d but uh yeah hologram on there and everything but uh, really cool all right there you go one up wednesday for you thanks a lot for joining me this is your friend dano remember slow traffic keep right and have a great rover day